Okay, here is another optimization problem where we are going to maximize the area. Here's the dilemma. An architect is designing a composite window, meaning two things, just like composite functions, right? Uh, by attaching a semicircular window on top of a rectangular window so that the diameter of the circle um, is equal to the width of the rectangle. If the architect wants the perimeter of the composite window to be 12 feet, what dimension should the bottom window be in order to create the composite window with the largest area? So we're maximizing area. But let's do the setup. So here's the semicircular part of the window, and here's the rectangle. That dashed line, that's not material. That's not material of the 12 feet. The 12 feet includes half of the circum, circum the circumference of half of circle, and then the outside measurement of rectangle with one of the sides missing. So 12 feet is equal to one half of two pi r, because that's the circumference of a circle. And those cancel, leaving pi r. And then Normally, there's for perimeter of a rectangle, it's twice length plus twice width, but there's only one width, so that cancels. Um, and then the area formulas and the rest of the work will be on this side, and I'll let you go ahead and kind of follow the steps, and hopefully you understand what's going on. That's it.